Hello again, it's Joey John McGuire. I'm in my uh, favourite pub once again. It's uh, a Witherspoon's pub, the Plough and Harrow in Hammersmith. That's London, the United Kingdom. I'm about to uh, recite my latest poem, which I did in the early hours of this morning, as I'm very nocturnal, and it's called Checkmate. I am but a pawn, and you are the unknown fingertips that shall, without heart, shove me forwards or backwards on this checkered chessboard, which is by design a battlefield, a place where victory or defeat will be recognized, my life or death finally balanced with the odds greatly in your favor, my existence quite unarguably in your hands, or shall I say your fingertips. I know not who you are, your face hidden by the many facets of disguise, meaning you have no face to recognize. You are just the driving force that strives to be my master, and more importantly, my enemy, a formidable opponent determined to succeed and prepared to use any force or weapon in the quest for victory. I am but a mere fly awaiting the swat. My back is to the wall. I find myself in a cul-de-sac. Time for me is running out, my mind and body ravaged by this warfare, too exhausted to run, and I have nowhere left to run away. So the time is now upon me, and as tomorrow's sun rises on the horizon of my world, I wonder if it will be my last. This time I do not stand alone. I am shored up and supported by my advocate, who has volunteered to stand with me in this, the last battle, the final crusade in this long-running saga, and hopefully, with right on our side, we will draw the final blood to take victory on this battlefield of shame and bring an end to this stalemate, this fiasco of hypocrisy that is a stain on our civil liberties. And with this last act of defiance, in a voice to be heard across the land, we shall claim checkmate in all your names. Leave this battlefield with a victory over shame. Shame on you, you Tories and David Cameron.